Labrador Retriever is one of the most famous dog breeds in the world, well known for their hard-working, eager-to-please and loyal nature. These dogs also have a thing for being cute and playful all of their life. Easy-going, affectionate and hard-working labs are quite similar to their cousins, the Golden Retrievers. An average Labrador weighs 55 to 80 pounds, stands 21 to 24 inches tall at the shoulder and has a life expectancy of 10 to 12 years. Now let's get into the top 10 most interesting facts about the Labrador Retriever. Number 1. Their History Labrador Retrievers hail from the island of Newfoundland off the northeastern Atlantic coast of Canada. Originally called St. John's Dogs after the capital city of Newfoundland, Labs served as companions and helpers to the local fishermen beginning in the 1700s. Outsiders noticed the dog's usefulness and good disposition, and English sportsmen imported a few Labs to England to serve as retrievers for hunting. What's interesting about this breed is that these dogs were almost extinct by the end of the 1800s. In Newfoundland, the breed disappeared because of government restrictions and tax laws. Families were allowed to keep no more than one dog and owing a female was highly taxed, so girl puppies were culled from litters. In England, however, the breed survived and the Kennel Club recognized the Labrador Retriever as a distinct breed in 1903. The breed's popularity really began to take off after the Second World War and in 1991, the Labrador Retriever became the most popular dog registered with the American Kennel Club and they've held that distinction ever since. Number 2. Unlike many other dogs, Labradors love water. Labradors were bred for hunting near water. They were used for fishing and retrieving waterfowls, both of the tasks which demanded the dog to be able to swim. Therefore, they have water repellent coats to keep them warm, a thick tail sometimes referred to as an otter tail, which they use as a rudder and webbed feet to swim faster. The modern day labs still have these qualities and their love for water is still as strong as their ancestors. So if your Labrador joins you while you're taking a shower, don't get too surprised. Number 3. They're versatile working dogs. Labrador Retrievers are used in different fields. Thanks to their intelligence, eagerness to please, and hardworking nature, they are invaluable workers in whichever field they are used in. They are among the popular choices for service dogs, family dogs, search and rescue dogs, bomb and drug detection, and therapy dogs and also as hunting dogs. This explains how these dogs are so versatile. Number 4. They love to eat. A Labradors are dogs that won't say no to a treat. They'll just keep on eating even if they're full, so they might get obese quicker than other dogs. And what they eat is not only limited to edible things, they can chew on crayons, toys, shoes and clothes as well. Labradors will also often forage in garbage and counter surf for food. So to make sure that your dog does not get obese, be sure to take note of how much you feed their lab and make sure you exercise them a lot. Number 5. They're super energetic. Though many perceive Labradors as laid-back dogs, they were made to run, swim and work. Labs have high energy levels and a high potential for playfulness. So you need to make sure to give your lab ample exercise and play with him whenever he desires. It is also necessary to have a yard big enough for him to play in. In short, Labradors aren't suited to apartment living. Labs, if not given enough time to exercise, might also end up displaying destructive behaviors like chewing on objects around the house or escaping the yard. Number 6. Labradors are Achievers In 1981, a Labrador mix named Bosco won the election to be the honorary mayor of Sunol, California, beating out the two human candidates for the job. Bosco ran as the Republican and used the slogan, a bone in every dish, a cat in every tree, and a fire hydrant on every corner. Bosco remained the mayor until he died in 1994. Number 7. Labradors can tell you if you have cancer. Labradors are dogs with a powerful nose. They've been trained to sniff out and identify early stages of cancer. Through work with cancer cell samples, these dogs can learn to smell the disease. These canines can make a diagnosis by smelling a patient's breath, blood or stool. So far, the only known way to screen for early stages of ovarian cancer is letting a lab sniff the patient, which has very high success rates. Scientists believe the lab sniff out changes in volatile organic compounds that suggest cancer and their nose is not limited to just finding out if the patient has cancer. They can also know if the patient has diabetes just by sniffing the patient. Number 8. A Labrador made his way into a Led Zeppelin song. Anyone who has listened to Led Zeppelin's Black Dog might have noticed that the song is not about dogs at all. In fact, the name of the song was decided when a black Labrador was wandering around the Headley Grange studio while they were recording the album Led Zeppelin IV. That nameless black Labrador would wander the grounds and the band would feed it. And when they named the song, the thought of the canine came to their mind and as a result, they named the song Black Dog. 
Number 9. They have a high pain threshold. Much like their cousins, the Golden Retrievers, Labradors too have a high pain threshold. It means that they are able to keep their calm even while they receive wounds that would hurt any other dog. As a result, they are used in many search and rescue missions as well. But in the event that your lab receives injury and acts calm and collected, it is because of his high pain threshold. So do not be phased and be sure to take care of his wounds as soon as possible. Number 10. You're gonna have to get used to a lot of lab hair. Labradors are heavy shedders. They shed all year round, but like other dogs, shedding is heavier especially in spring and fall. They have a water repellent outer coat and a short hair coat underneath it to keep them warm. Although they are easy to groom, shedding is inevitable. Buy a quality vacuum cleaner and brush your dog daily, especially when they're shedding to get out the loose hair. They require bathing about every two months, but it depends on how often your lab rolls in a mud, puddle or something something foul which they might do. However, dog hair is not the only thing you'll have to get used to. You gotta prepare yourself to get used to barking and an active life as well. Of course, your lab can be trained to be quieter, but that just depends on you. Alright guys, that's it for the video about the top 10 most interesting facts about the Labrador Retrievers. Thank you so much for watching the video. If you have a lab, let us know in the comments how it is similar or different to what we've mentioned in the video. Please give it a thumbs up and share the video if you liked it. For more interesting content like this, click on our channel and of course don't forget to subscribe.